Hello everyone, it's me again, GW fan the Softcore Brony, welcome you back to Let's Play Emerald Dragon. Getting up to Helma Mira, whatever the heck it's called, Mountain, <laughs> is easy enough. Just go up this way, go around the right side of the water. If you went up the other way, you wouldn't have been able to make it uh, up here, so. Uh, here we are. Oh, yeah. Giant scorpions. Okay. Hasunam Sage. Okay. <laughs> it's like, I don't want to go with you! <laughs> anyway, I think we get some new dialogue now. Oh, yeah. That's about it. Actually, there are random encounters as well, but... What a jerk. He really doesn't like him. Well, I didn't say so last time, and I don't recall if they ever specifically say so, but Sir Julius is the champion of fire, uh, Karshwarl's father. So, yeah, he knows a thing or two about the champions. Although, uh, they don't really say much of anything about what the champions are all about, but... Oh, yeah. I don't know. The world never tells us. And I thought you'd cut all your ties with people. Huh. Anyway, yeah, first thing we want to do, let's go over here and collect a hundred paris. Why do so many chests have this? Seriously, what the heck? Anyway, well, actually, these guys aren't really new. The gargoyles, those... No, actually, we met those... Did we? Or did we? Now I'm getting confused. I know we've met these poisonous snakes before. Didn't we meet you already? Perhaps. Actually, yeah, I should have went after the gargoyles. Because they're a little bit more annoying. Thanks for hitting the other one! Thank you. Oh, there we go. That's better. Yeah, primitive. I don't think we have met you guys yet, have we? We met the other guys that look like you. That's what it was. Anyway. So much for those guys. Yeah, not too bad. So you go up here. Not a salt flower. Not that we really need them, but... Oh, yeah, now we're- wait, 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 wait! Karshwarl! <sighs> so, Shion, target, uh, this guy. We don't need- we don't care about the freaking nightmares right now. There we go. I don't think that's quite enough to kill him, but... Wait, wait. Little bit left, you might be able to take him out. Oh, yeah, perfect. Yeah, no one gives a crap about the nightmares. All they do is multiply and heal, so they're easy enough to deal with once uh, all the other enemies are gone. Just like in every other battle they're featured in, which is way too many, honestly, way too many boss fights. Which is really, really sad, but, uh... You couldn't have attacked the one that I was already attacking, huh? Oh well, whatever. I suppose I could just cut the rest of this battle out. I mean, it's just these guys doing that. Oh, and Cameron actually being... Well, are we gonna... He might get to... Ooh, you crazy points. Oh, we haven't even seen that yet, have we? Yeah, she actually learned that, like, back at, like, level 31, and I actually did see it in one battle, but I... It was one that I was cutting out anyway. <laughs> it seemed kind of insignificant to do it for, like, just one thing. But yeah, she'll increase the character's points for a turn. I, I think... I, I'm not sure... I think it's only one turn. It might be for the full battle, but... Yeah, she increases, uh, points a little bit. Like, by, like, four, as you saw. So it can be useful, but... She doesn't do it very often. Certainly not often enough. Let's see, got a couple treasures here. Diamonds, sweet. 
I'm surprised. She increased those chance uh, points again. Another diamond. I guess I could have waited to sell those, but... I actually had two other diamonds to sell anyway. And a wind hat. Oh, yeah! That's right! I have all this money now because of all the stuff I sold. And I should have left a note last time, but yeah, make sure you still have the uh, hard gloves and diamond hammer. And technically, you really shouldn't get rid of the bunny gloves, depending on what you do actually in this place right here. So, oh, and the uh, the wind hat. The uh, first of two helmets for Sociant, not terribly great. The second one's not even that great either, <laughs> honestly. But yeah, he's not really a... I mean, his defense doesn't matter anyway, because he's in the back, so... Even though we actually did get attacked in that last uh, battle from those uh, poisonous snakes, but... Anyway. Cameron keeps buffing Sociant, and he doesn't get a turn! Sheesh. Anyway. 100 Paris? Really? I don't know what's up with that. Tamron, stop buffing Sociant when he's not even gonna get another turn! Get another Warmole's Medicine? Nice. Good grief, Tamron. Alright, yeah, I don't need to get that treasure now. It's kind of annoying that it's blocking our way, though. <laughs> Level up for Tamron. Nice. And before we get that Scorpion up there... Ha-ham! The Earth Staff! A awesome little weapon for Tamron there. It'll actually serve her for most of the rest of the game. Uh, Earth Staff? Yeah, increases points by flipping six! So, alright! And increases agility a little bit, too, and intelligence, of course, so... Nice. Yeah, this is, uh... Where is it? Yeah, this makes her points, uh... Like, right up there with attrutions now, so... Yeah, 23, not bad, and you got, what, 20, 23, all right! I think, actually, I think, like, one or two more levels is gonna get 24 anyway, but... <laughs> yeah. Every little point increases Attrition's power by a lot because of that, uh, weapon he currently has, but anyways... Let's see... Health... Actually, we're doing pretty good health-wise, but... Might as well use a tent, I mean, we have him. deal with these, uh, killer scorpions you were so worried about. Let's see. Alright, everyone... Okay, you're already going to do it, but yeah, just to make sure... Target him. Sociant, also target him. And Tamron, if you decide to attack, target him as well. Yeah, not too bad, as long as everyone goes after one particular scorpion at a time. So, yeah, I don't want to use my dragon powers right now. In fact, I want to defend as well. Just to reduce damage a little bit. Oh, so close. Even though they actually... Yeah, that's actually a physical attack right there. So, yeah, that hurts... Ow. Him a lot. Dude, you jerks! Better not attack him again. Oh, jerks. Well, so much for Sociant. I guess I could have given him thanks. I wonder if he would have... No, he wouldn't have died if I hadn't given him that extra. Yeah. Oh well. Whatever, that's the first time I've ever lost him. Yeah, unfortunately that counts as a physical attack, so I guess I could have given him his other... Well, no, I don't have it anymore, so never mind. Yeah, just do it. Hmm. Come on. Ow. Jerks. Oh. Okay, yeah, that unfortunately that won't take effect until her next turn, but okay. I can live with that. Alright. And last guy. Sorry, Sociant. Ow. I guess I could heal a little bit. I mean, I've got all these high potions. That way she'll actually hopefully do something useful. There we go. Yeah, she actually has enough points to heal twice. Now. Come on, Tamran! You have all those points and that's all you did? Hey. 
Good grief. Oh well. Someone's for Sociant, but it's not like it really he he gets experience points anyway, and he'll be alive now, so with one HP. So anyway, might as well use a tent. <laughs> Good grief, Sociant. Actually, for this part, right here, get in there. Yeah, let's uh, turn up our uh, walk speed for a moment, because this part's just kind of ridiculous. Yeah, look how flipping fast that is! It's ridiculous! But, uh... <laughs> Dagnabbit, eh? Haven't heard that in a long time. It is! He's half dead, but yes! Oh, really? You're that smart, eh? Yeah, he did. Scoundrel. It's alright, Socian. I mean, it's not your fault you suck. Well, semi-suck, really. <laughs> Honestly, when you get down to it. Um, okay. Isn't that still technically help? Well, I guess information isn't really direct help, is it? But anyway. Yeah, we can talk... Uh, well, actually, we have to ask a whole bunch of questions. Let's talk about these uh, Horus, the old gods that we've heard a little bit about so far. Uh-huh, before the dragons. And they were called the Horus. Only 3,000 years ago, eh? Oh. I see. Which is where we are at, the Holy Land. Oh, wow. Yeah. But they don't re uh, produce children much, so... Oh. Huh. Okay. Yeah, that in-game area, yeah, that's the desert over there. <laughs> I mean, in-game monsters, sorry. Not an in-game area, necessarily, but yeah, in-game monsters are there for whatever reason. And then he runs away to another part of the house for some stupid reason. Randomly, four different locations. Oh, besides the one he's in. Uh, let's see, let's ask about the Emerald... Yeah, we had to ask all of them. So, Emerald Graces? Yeah, we kind of know that already. Oh, and that's why they did that, huh? Okay. Oh, Garcia has one. Well, crud. But we don't know where the other one is? Uh, oh, he didn't run away? Wow, he usually runs away after every question. I'm surprised. Yeah, what about that old emerald dragon? The champion of the dragons! Oh, yeah? How do you know him? I don't know how old he's supposed to be. Then he runs away to another part of the house, either over there or up here or back where he started. That's why I wanted the speed <laughs> walking there. Because, good grief. Yeah, how about that Garcia? Well, then what the hell? Oh. Uh, good question. Stop running away! There you are. And the Apesta? Uh-huh. Oh. Where have I heard that before? Really? Okay. Why? Hmm. There you are. Uh, an Ostracon? That foolish fool! Yeah, he did. The Archdemon, huh? <laughs> no, he's not. <laughs> he's not! <laughs> yeah, I don't believe you, old man. And you're back over there again. I missed you, but I still talked to you anyway. Okay. And... How about Tamron's secret, since apparently you know that? Oh, does she? Okay. 
And this is not related to Cameron's secrets. This is just after you've answer, or asked all the questions. So I understand perfectly unless you want to ask them again for some reason. Or any one of them again. And one more thing. Who oh, is it? Is it? Is it? All right, what is it? What? Holy crap! How do you know that? But dang! So, you're telling me Farna didn't have to lead the party? Huh. Warimal, a famous doctor who does it. Yeah, see, Warimal's potions. I told you we hadn't met the guy yet. Well, okay, awesome. Yeah, I did. Uh, sure. I thought you were gonna give us something. Where'd you go? Oh, that's right, he's outside. I was. Why do you do that? Hmm? Uh, actually, he did not give us a heal potion. He actually gave us a heal gen. The one that uh, heals all HP to one character. Don't use it or sell it. We need that for something later. You got a nymph mushroom, which, whatever. Even though, actually, sleep's a lot stronger than I thought, but... And he gives us a crash ruby, which I'll just sell, because they're kind of overpowered if you get a whole bunch of them, because they're actually coming up to the point in the game where you can start buying them. <laughs> so... <laughs> <laughs> and make every boss a, a freaking joke. And it's a bonus. Oh. Okay. What's that? Oh, we get the Hama arrow. Oh! Oh, sweet! We need that. Don't mess up this time, Sociot! <laughs> Alright. Awesome. Alright, so we got all that. And we learned about Hothram! Yay! Someone tell Farna! Except we don't know where she is. <laughs> She's nowhere in the world if we go look for her, unfortunately, so... What other... Oh, yeah, the Horus and the Vesta and all that other stuff. I guess it's not really that great of news. Hmm, I see. Must be a presence. I guess... But, uh, before we leave, let's bug the old man again. Hey, man. Yeah! Rob him blind and run like hell! Haven't heard that one for a little while, not since Breath of Fire 2. <laughs> That's probably more true than it ought to be, sadly. Talk to you again. Yeah, I do. Talk to me. Oh. Well, darn. But hey, let's bug him again! Yeah, another reason why I wanted to have this high speed. Oh, yeah? Well, let's bug him some more, then! Yep. Let's bug him again anyway! How about we bug him again anyway? Yep. Nah, let's still bug him some more, because why the hell not? And again! How about one more time? No? Oh, but wait, let's actually leave the place first and kind of come back here.
Ah, I see, I see. I'm not sure if it's actually like the leading part or like it's some random number <laughs> that does it because I've actually had it where I've left the place and come back and he still did the whole running away thing. But uh, yeah, if you bug him enough, <laughs> he'll offer to give us something else, so. Oh, we get to pick one! Ooh, look at all this nice stuff. How about this uh, dragon killer sword? Oh. Oh, yeah, yeah, actually, that, 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 uh, makes sense, since, you know, Trushin's a dragon and all. Okay, uh, how about your staff there? Oh. Well, how about the, uh, Orpheo's hat, whatever that is? It is? Uh, okay. How about the crystal robe? Oh. Actually, it's kind of annoying that he does that because uh, we actually, because the uh, among the items we've looked at so far, the crystal robe is one that we can get later. Uh, not from him, but from somewhere else. So, uh, the only things we actually can choose from are the protect ring and the crash ruby. If you choose the crash ruby, he'll actually... <laughs> oh, actually, let's uh, go ahead and show that real quick. Why not? I'm not sure. You get a crash ruby, which is stupid. How sad. So he'll give us 9,646 Paris. It's a weird number. But let's not do that. Let's take the protect ring instead. Oh, it does. I would greatly appreciate it. And we get the protect ring, the most defensive shield in the game. So, yeah. <laughs> it's well worth it uh, to bug him all that time. I, well, kind of. Uh, 800 defense, it totally goes to waste on Tamron, but it is stronger. You know, it is something for her. Uh, if you end up missing the protect ring or not getting it for whatever reason, then do not sell the bunny gloves. Uh, we're gonna still we'll still need them for later if you do if you uh, don't. So uh, yeah, we're gonna give where is it? Tamron the protect ring. You actually cannot sell the silver ring. It's a priceless item, <laughs> so they just don't let you sell it. So uh, oh yeah, I need to sell skull rod and a couple other things. But I'm keeping the forest bandana for sentimental reasons because dang it, I like Yaman. He was awesome. He's better than Sociant. <laughs> so. Uh, I don't think there's actually... Oh, yeah, let's turn that speed back down now. Yeah, I don't think there's any more... Uh... Art group? No. Er, no, either. <laughs> I'm not used to affecting the speed there, but yeah, I don't... Are there any more monsters here? There might still be monsters, but yeah, we need to get back to... Uh... Wait, where are we going? We're not going back to the city here. Oh, yeah, we are going back. Or no? Oh, actually, I think we actually are going to be... Uh... Is there an event here? Oh, we'll find out next time on Let's Play Emerald Dragon. Arrivederci!